Hello guys. I was on the internet the other day. What am I talking about? I'm on it every day. But anyway, I was on it and I came across this man um, talking about how um, there was a study that said that a North American men or I guess he was saying more American men were going across to Europe to look for more traditional wives because uh, North American women were not traditional enough and how all these women were growing older and saying, oh, where, where is these men? Where, where's my husband? And I just thought, what a load of crap. For one, if women or if men from here go to get European wives, what happens to all the European men? If there was none left for them, they'd come over here, right? And it's almost it's almost like saying what society has been saying to women for ages. It's it's saying if you want to keep a man, you have to act less than you are. You have to be uh, different somehow. You have to be not as um, full as you want. Not saying that there aren't women who would gladly be, um, you know, homemakers and raise children. That would be their sole job. There's nothing wrong with that. There are plenty of women out there who want that. And I think there's a lot of men who want that. And there's men who want women who can do more than that or something different than that, and, or they're okay with either. Um, why are women supposed to be less? Less is wrong. Less is the wrong word for it. Why are women supposed to be not their full selves or only this idea of what they should be according to some men. Um, I think if you're destined to be with someone, you will be. And if you're not, you won't. And to be something than what you, you are, um, to appease someone else or make them feel more important or raise their ego up is wrong. And to say to women that this is what um, is going on and going to happen is like, um, it's, it's a false tale. I mean, when I was a child, I used to think uh, swallowing an apple seed would grow an apple in my stomach. An apple tree, that is. I don't do that anymore. And people telling me that doesn't change what I know. I can't go backwards on, on lies or assumptions. And why should any human being have to be less or different than what they really are. You want to be a homemaker and, and raise children and that be your primary uh, focus in life? That's beautiful. That's wonderful. Um, all the power to you, do that. And, and hopefully you'll find a man who, or a partner who likes that for you, who's, who's fine with all that. But there are so many women who don't want to do that and to be cut off from options doesn't make this world a better place. So stop with the scare tactics. It's not working. Um, it's, it's ridiculous. 
most of the women overseas who want American or Canadian men, um, part of it is money that they want, and part of it is more freedom that they think they're going to get. So do you think by these um, traditional women coming over that they're going to accept to stay in one spot and not change in their life? I, I think that's um, foolish to think this. And it's a dumb thing to worry about. So what I'm saying is Men, if you want a, uh, if you want a traditional woman, uh, go look for one. Women, if you want a traditional man, go look for one, and leave everybody else alone. And we will find whatever we find. I doubt that the human race is going to stop. So. <laughs> We, we got to stop that. For some reason, it's a lot of this incel young men under 40 that are doing this or putting this out. And do they realize that women have been told this for decades, um, probably hundreds of years, to calm down, don't be so aggressive or you'll never catch a man. We've been there. We don't want to do that. If you want, like I said, said, I'll say it again. If you want that kind of life and that kind of partner, partner, then find it. If you don't, then find what you're looking for. There's room enough for everyone on this big blue marble. There's a sock for every sock and a shoe for every shoe. And fear mongering doesn't help any of us. So this is just a little short public service announcement. <laughs> um, yeah. Let's be nice to each other. Women and men are human beings. We don't need to to follow some sort of, of, of rule. I mean, So guys, I will do more later. This is a short one. I just had to, I had a bee in my bonnet, a, a literal bzzz in my bonnet, and I had to uh, get that out. So, see you soon.